Hi you guys, I'm back again. You girl got your be mommy. And I'm sorry I have not introduced myself in many other videos. I've been trying to get out the message. It's been so much of overload of messages that you guys need to hear. Even if it's about twin flame or just what's going on in divine masculine life or what's going on in your life or anything else of sort. But here goes. What I'm seeing is I pulled some cards and I just didn't feel like posting the cards. I just felt like listen to the sound of my voice and what I'm going to say to you guys. Well, the first card that I pulled, you know what to do. That made me think about what you need to do. You know what to do. You could be questioning yourself about what to do with this connection. You could have somebody that you really want to be with or you was in a relationship with a karmic. It doesn't matter. Whatever your situation is right now, the universe is saying you know what to do. You could be trying to figure out as of right now, as I'm speaking, what to do with my current situation. It seems so hard. I've been waiting on him or her for so long. What to do? Well, they're saying in all battles of the heart over the mind, go with your heart. Because truly, it's a lot easier for you to mind to catch up with your heart than for your heart to catch up with your mind. It's a whole lot. The universe say is not that I don't love your mind. You got to figure out what you want because nine out of ten, you be the person who has to deal with the current situation. Not your father, not your mother, not your brother, nor your sister. Anybody that's involved in a situation, take what resonates. Then I got the message was, you need not to worry. Whatever you're worrying about, stop worrying about it because it's only clearing out the positive energy that you need to be absorbing. The more you worry about something, the more it push the good energy away. And you're sitting there like, oh my God, panicking, having panic attacks or anything of sort. Can't sleep, sick, sick, I just said sick. So some of you guys could be sick, worrying about the situation. And what the universe want to tell you is there's no one in your life who hasn't always loved you. They're all just learning how to show it the universe wants to tell you that you don't need to worry and it came out again as I shuffle another deck it came out again no need to worry it came out twice so that told me a lot of you counterparts divine feminine divine masculine are literally worrying about this situation possibly even worrying about the karmic or the karmic worrying about you it doesn't matter who's worrying about who right now you need to like literally figure out what you're gonna do and what i mean what you're gonna do is you need to set some time apart from people places and things and get your mind together some of you guys can meditate some of you guys can pray some of you guys do all sorts of things to get your mind away from what's really bothering you. But have you ever attacked the problem by asking yourself who, what, when, why, and how? And that's something that a lot of people forget to ask themselves. Like, who am I? Some people really don't know the answer. So the angels are telling you begin now take your first step it's time for you to take the step on your journey some of you guys like to go out into the field and plant things some of you guys have farms and stuff and they want you to plant your crops it doesn't matter some some of you guys like to buy flowers or seeds to plant anything and right now is the time to do that because what i'm seeing in this card is telling me that you guys, God has been literally putting the answers in your head. And it's time for you to answer the call. Some of you guys have been getting a call from that person that you've been 
worrying about and now you're stuck trying to figure out what to say how to do things the right way i'm here to tell you the more you procrastinate the more you don't get nowhere so it's like telling you the time is now right now some of you have a voyage of the heart what that means is love flow through you and to you it's time for you to love on you or send out the love love is been missing for a long time from you guys life because your counterpart has not been there to where you harden your heart your heart is so frozen right now you need to unthaw it because right now you're being protected by the angels the angels are protecting you and what i'm seeing in the card the angel is actually holding a amethyst crystal on his sword with a great smile on his face so it's telling me that you guys may like crystals you guys need to get your crystals up and sage them or some of the crystals you have or you don't have any crystals you could should get some because they actually work amplify the energy it's time to cleanse them it's time for you a lot of um people to take a spiritual bath to cleanse your energy because what's happening is you need love you want love it's like it's there but you're not looking at that you're like oh no i've been hurt so bad i'm not doing that again well the point of it all is love is an action it's not just a word you got to follow it so most people ask how do you love when you've been hurt it starts with you it's time for you to get out and enjoy your time because the angels are literally amplifying the energy right now right now we just probably had a moon a double moon and leo which is called the black moon that was a time to rest reflect and to see everything for what it is and to open up your mind your soul your spirit in order to elevate some people don't know how to elevate well i'm here to share information with you how to go about on your journey to heal because being hindered is one thing that you do not want from anyone that you love so if you need any answers please email me the email is under the description box you can subscribe to my channel that will help the energy flows and the more I can keep posting, the more I can give information to you guys. I love giving out messages because this is what I do. I am an empath, a very strong one. Sometimes I can sit and get messages with no cards. And I'm going to post some videos with me telling you the energy without any cards. And the angels will clarify them later on. Time is fluent. Time of the essence. I want you guys to heal, learn from your current situation and grow. Some are divine feminine, some are divine masculine. Even the karma needs to grow because everything is stuck and stagnated right now. And it's time for you guys to heal. Thank you for listening to my message.